Tokyo. Let's get this done. My name is Austin George. Just got first at Omaha Regional with Danger Dark World FTK. Um, so, start of the main deck, we got two Bigfoot, two Thunderbird, three Dogman, three Mothman, three Nessie, three Chupacabra, two Suchinoko, the Snake, uh, three Jackalope, and those are all my dangers. I uh, like the ratios, I'd probably play a third Snake over a third Mothman, otherwise everything else is really nice. Kind of, I don't know. A lot of people like to cut these, but I think you need more cards to do so. I'm not playing like all the warriors resold, so it, it kind of, I don't know, just meshed together. They're, they're all free cards. It's super free good. cards are good cards. And then for the Dark World, just grab a three snow, three breath. That's it. That's all you need. It's great. You just got to play around them like DD Crow in this or just make sure it doesn't happen. That, that's the only way you lose. Or if like Firewall gets cherries. But that's about it. And then the monsters play one beast, you send that off Armageddon or uh, Curious. One Zephyros and then three Armageddon. And then the beautiful card, Tomb Cannon Soldier. I know normal Cannon Soldier is better to play, but I have an Ultra, so why not? Swag. Is it signed? No. Then you suck. It's, pretty, it's cool, it's an Ultra. Then for the spells, just play Reborn, Soul Charge. These cards are phenomenal. Card Destruction. I only played two beginning then, I didn't want to play three. So I found myself opening multiples a lot and I couldn't use them. So it's better just to play two. Because if you open one, you can, you can get to it really easy. And then you can just draw on the other one later. Uh, and then three lower. That's all you need. It, it's amazing. The deck's 42. Um, and the extra play. It's my field center. It's cool. And then it plays adorable tokens. And then we play the Xyz monsters. Play Levier. Um, like a lot of the time, at the beginning of your combo, you can banish Tune Cannon Soldier off the lure, and then you can just get it back with this later. It's really nice and gets the clog out of your hand. And the best card in this deck is this, this garbage, but then it goes into this thing. As a thought, this card is amazing. Like, a lot of people are just saving their hand traps for like Firewall or any, I don't know, whatever. If they didn't draw me right away, I just try to make this as soon as possible. You drop this and they can't play. It, it's great, and then you just kill them. But that's it. And Tomahawk for your link plays. Just going at two sevens. It's good. Um, and for the links, played one link spider. You make up to tokens. One mermaid. Uh, you can make it with your nightmares later to get more stuff from Firewall from your hand. And then, like, if they give you the ability, it's kind of good. Uh, and then we play Reprodocus. Uh, Cerberus and Phoenix, those are just generic. This helps you with the summon sword combo. Um, then for rank threes, he's got Unicorn. Curious, this card is insane. It's literally like amazing. You just send whatever you want, then you mill, it's more cards. And then summon sword, that's all you need. They're, they're all amazing cards. It's like if they, if they get rid of your firewall, if they ogre it, or if they like impermanence it or negate it, you just shuffle back to this, make it again. It's cool. And then for the fours, we just play Firewall, the, the amazing card here, uh, Saruja, the other amazing card. Literally like every game, we just go into this and then this. And then my my alternate plan is if, if they do draw me, I just try and go to Gumblar and then just try and make a more discard more cards. So it's, it's pretty good. So that's that. And then side, play Sphere Mode in case I get extra linked, which did happen today, and I Sphere Moded him. And then killed everything else and left him with just that. It's great. Uh, Drolls, they're good against the mirror and everything else. And then Reapers, I should probably put this up to three because I needed it at one point and I didn't have it in my hand. Um, I didn't play against Thunder Dragons at all, surprisingly, but uh, this was for them and then it's also good against like Trickstar or random stuff. Um, I don't know, it's kind of maybe. Uh, Twin Twister is amazing. This card is the best for me today. It literally, I was staring down games of like Vanity's Fiend, uh, Conductor Tyranno, Pankatrops, and it, just, it puts them down and then you just kill them with Thunderbird, you just kill them, it's great. Uh, and then Imperial Order, uh, Eradicator, and I only have one Impermanent, so I'm only playing one. Um, this card is nuts too. I mean, it's just an auto win against any trap deck or like Sky Striker or anything that relies on spells. So yeah, it's good. Um, that's it. Uh, shout out to all my Omaha UBO friends. You guys are great. Yeah, that's it. All right. Thanks for the deck profile, bro.
We do good. Peace.